hi guys welcome back in this video tutorial we are gonna learn about communication between parent and child components in react js so let's get started uh, i have this is a one file the app.js you can see that the output here and i'm going to make one more component which is child you can see that here so i'm going to include this here import and name child this is the name of the child component from folder name so folder name is same so that we can use child fine guys so just 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 copy and paste this thing here because or uh, most of the things we need the same like uh, I'm going to change here like child component and I'm going to make this name child here and import child from here I don't need that So I think everything is perfect for now. Just try to use it. There's no error. So I just put it here. And let's see the output. You can see that we are able to see the child component here. So I'm going to remove it. Top line okay so this is the very basic where you can we can see that uh, how to import a child component here now i want to pass some data from here like uh, i'm going to make a attribute here this is data or i just pass here hello child and for here uh I can print like print like that. Uh, just this dot props dot data. That means the property which is come from our uh, parent and the name of the property is data. You can see that the output is hello child. If I'm going to change here something like that, hello son then you can see that output is changed here fine guys so now just pass a function with that i'm going to make a function here like uh, child call I'm, I'm going to just print something like alert hello this call from child component so now I'm going to pass here like uh, uh one more property i need child call equal to yes i need it like that this dot child call and we can bind this function with the this so we are able to pass the this from parent to child okay so now i'm going to make a button here okay just try to call it with the component will mount we need a small c here and just call this 
how we can call that function this dot props dot function name which is uh, child goal yes child goal let's see you can see that hello this call from the child so this is a way how we can do that uh, how we can call the parent function with the child component okay let's see once more again. Uh, we just create a function here and we pass a property which is the child call you can put whatever you want here and then uh, pass this function with this property and you can call this function directly here Oops. you can call this function directly here. Let if you want to call it with on a button click then fine then create a button on click and use an arrow function put this function here and close the button now oops click me to four a lot Okay, see that. Okay, so I think you can uh, understand it easily because this is a very simple. Like, uh, just create a child component, pass it with the property, and you can call it here. So thanks, guys. Thanks for watching this video. And if you find that if you find any difficulty to understand this program, then let me comment. I will. Uh, definitely help you and you can find this code uh, with the description uh, here is a link for my github account thanks guys thanks for watching this video